है गाइज वेलकम टू अनदर ब्लॉग एंड टुडे फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल इफ यू आर वंडरिंग कि मैंने जैकेट क्यों पहनी है डिस्पाइट द सनी वेदर एंड यू आर रॉन्ग बिकॉज एटलांटाज वेदर कीप ऑन चेंजिंग एवरी डे एंड इट इट रेन हैवीली ये स्टे डेज एंड दैट्स वाई इट इज सुपर कोल्ड टुडे इट्स लाइक फाइव डिग्री सेल्सियस सो दैट्स वाई आई एम वेयरिंग जैकेट सो नाउ टुडे इज द डे दैट आई विल बी रिवेलिंग माई रूममेट्स टू यू ऑल ऑफ यू गाइज एंड यू विल गेट टू नो कि मेरे रूममेट्स इंडियन है कि अमेरिकन सो नाउ लेट्स मीट दैम Sorry, the room is again messy. I cleaned it last time, but it is again messy. And now, uh, let's meet the second roommate first because the first roommate is busy. So, hi, John. So, what you're making? Oh, hi, Harnoor. <laughs> Didn't think I'd see you here. <laughs> making a cup of coffee. What are you up to? Uh, no, much. Just, just was making a video. So, meet one of the most hardworking roommate I ever had. So, he works on three jobs. So what what are the three jobs do you work on? The three jobs I do. I'm a carpenter, a contractor, and a tutor. Oh, amazing! So I don't have a lot of free time, but whenever I do, I'm usually in the kitchen making coffee and reading a book. Amazing! And uh, what? Where are you from, basically? Uh, Jersey. Uh -huh. And I've been here in Georgia for about one year and five months. Amazing! And one last question: What's your favorite part of Atlanta? <laughs> My favorite part of Atlanta, <sighs> because I guess living with you, Harnoor. Wow, amazing! Having an incredible roommate, two incredible roommates, uh, who are very laid back and very cool, and we hang out, uh, work out, and we all just get along. We cook food, we play cards, so life is good. And besides that, there's a lot going on here in the city. Um, You know, whenever I do have any free time, I'll go to a show or a concert or see friends. And there's always places to go, and there's always stuff to do. So, you know, I like being here in uh, Atlanta, and definitely looking forward to living here next year too. So we're gonna have a lot of fun. Amazing! I feel so lucky that I also have one of the best two roommates. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> so now, time to meet the first roommate. Uh, oh hey Harner, nice to see you. What a surprise! Yeah. So meet my first roommate. So we have been living from the last two years. Yeah. Cool. So yeah, come on in. <laughs> so, uh, hi Zmin. So, uh, so where are you from? Uh, oh, I'm from up in New York, but my parents are from Bangladesh. And major? Uh, uh yeah. So I'm a PhD student here at Georgia State University. And uh, I recently completed the requirements for my master's in physics, so uh, I'm pursuing PhD in astrophysics. Oh, amazing! And what's the best part about uh, studying at Georgia State University? Uh, uh, well, or, or living here? <laughs> oh, it's uh... <laughs> it's the weather, yes, because uh, New York gets super cold, right? So that oh, be... that's right. Yes, I I don't miss the snow. Uh, <laughs> it it gets very cold in New York. Exactly. <laughs> Perfect. Yeah, awesome. yeah, yeah. I love the weather here. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> <laughs> so those were one of the most nice, most humble, and most caring roommates I ever had in the last three years. So now let's get back into time. So the first day I entered the United States, so I was having two roommates as well when I lived on campus. So one of them was from Japan, and one of them was from France. So I never got the chance to stay with Indians. I mean, I never had Indian roommates. So you would wonder that. I am like uh, I don't like Indian roommates, but that's not the case. It was just that whenever I was looking for roommates, I always found uh, different or roommates from different culture and from different countries. So that's why it was one of the most fun experience in the last years. And when you meet people from different culture and society, you learn more from them rather than living with people from the same culture. And that's why I kind of like living with unique or people from different background all the time. And in the last three years, I had roommates from. South Africa, uh, France, Japan, uh, even Pakistan, and and you have already met my current roommates. So I have lived with all kinds of roommates, and it was 
most fun journey ever so the best things i've learned include uh, cooking so for example when i had my first roommates they had a meal plan so i never got the chance to cook because i was never inspired but now as i see my roommates cooking all the time so i get inspired to cook healthy food every day so i cook myself as well and one very important thing that i would like to share is that few of my friends have complained that when they were living with people from same culture they were having some kind of arrogance and ego issue for example when they were living in the same room sharing room with each other and they, when, when they wanted to study and when the other person gets a phone call then he doesn't step out of the room he instead accepts the call in the same room and that's kind of annoying that if one student is studying and another student is picking up the call so it is it leads to some kind of disturbance so that's why it is very important for you to choose your roommates wisely and you can even sip, sit or stay separately just like i am so we are like kind of living in three different rooms so it is a lot more convenient as well so that was the entire conclusion and now i have bought a new pressure cooker so i will be cooking chicken and brow rice so i will see you guys in the next one goodbye Let's actually do it tomorrow when I shave, like maybe. Yeah, sure, perfect. Uh, tomorrow works. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Man, Harnoor, keep it up. Yep. And he's one of the best roommate I ever had. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. See you later. See you. So I'll keep it. Yeah, you. sure. You can just keep it open. <laughs> I mean, whatever. <laughs> whatever. <laughs>